You can tell by the red that's right here that I've got my curtain pulled back because it's a bit of a dreary day today. But hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Avery here. I've got the camera in a bit of a different angle here, so that's why you're seeing all the crap behind me. <laughs> but I wanted to post a bit of a different video today. Um, the uploads have been stagnant, obviously, and I've been debating about how I wanted to talk about this and talk about everything that's been going on. Uh, I know that we have a lot of new subscribers to the channel, obviously from 1,000 to 13, now almost 1,400. And so I wanted to kind of just update you on what's going on. Um, first off, I want to give a shout out to everybody that supports the channel, whether you donate or don't, and you don't need to donate, even if you're just buying a copy of my book on Amazon, or if you're watching a video and you're, you know, I don't know, watching an ad, if you're just liking the video, you know, I, I want to thank each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart for doing that. Um, I always do like to shout out the people that donate to the channel, like Seto Kaiba's bank account, which I still think is the funniest name in the world, um, for donating to the, to the channel. I really do appreciate it. Um, but what has been going on recently is that my health has not been very good. Uh, for those of you who are newer to the channel and maybe don't know, I was diagnosed with von Hippel-Lindau disease back when I was 22. I'm 27 now, uh, which is a type of very rare cancer. It's extremely rare, like one in 10,000 people are documented in the US every year, um, which even then that information is not even entirely accurate because it's just so rare. And I have been recently experiencing some heart issues. If you remember a while back, I posted a video talking about how I felt like I had, I experienced what was a heart attack. And I, looking back on that video now, I don't really think it was a heart attack, but I do think that I've been having some issues with my breathing, been having some issues with uh, my heart health, my health in general overall. And so I've really been trying to balance between that, working a very stressful job in the pharmaceutical industry as a pharmacy technician, um, and then also trying to make videos for you. And because of my health being just so out of whack, I've been taking a break from the game of Yu-Gi-Oh! I still don't know if I'm going to be going to the YCS in North Carolina in April. I'm hoping that we have a new ban list by then because Fire Kings is just so oppressive. Um, I actually ended up putting a buy list together yesterday uh, on CoolStuffGames.com just to kind of get some cards off of uh, my shoulders, I guess, for lack of a better term, so that I could at least make a couple hundred bucks. Um to have, you know, for the next format. But my health is not doing very good right now. And because of that, um, I've really had to focus less on YouTube and more on, on my health. As much as I want to make YouTube a full-time career, um, even on a channel with 1,400 subscribers, that's not entirely possible. And so... I'm waiting for my heart monitor to come in the mail. I'm waiting for all that to come through. Um, trying to figure out the stress in my life and how to handle it. Wor working in the pharmaceutical industry is a very stressful job compared to when I you know, became a technician six years ago. Uh, for those of you who are not familiar with the pharmaceutical industry, industry, just look up like pharmacy technician jobs and you'll see what I'm talking about. It's, it's a very stressful environment. Um, I work with great people. Uh, I get along with all my coworkers and my managers. It's just the day-to-day -day workload is just so stressful that I'm sure anybody working in a high-stress environment can relate, right? I mean, I'm I'm a guy who worked in a radio station and was, you know, treated abusively because of my medical diagnosis. It, it was very toxic. So the uploads have stagnated because of that. I was on, I, if you remember, like, gosh, even six months ago, I was on a daily upload grind. Where I was left bulleting every one to two days, whether it was a discussion, a deck profile, something to talk about the game of Yu-Gi-Oh! And now I've just been sort of taking a break because I have my invite. You know, I don't need to be grinding out the regionals when I already have my invite to nationals. That doesn't mean that I suddenly hate the game. It's just that I want to save my money instead of spending almost $1,000 on a fucking Fire King deck that I don't need to spend my money on, right? And so... I've really just been trying to focus on my health as of late, and I don't know if I'm going to need surgery. I don't know if I'm going to need to be medicated. I don't know if I'm going to have to quit my pharmacy job just to figure out my life. 
I know that my life has been very uprooted since uh, I worked at a local television station here in Jacksonville, Florida, about two years ago now. And it was politics in the workplace. I was sabotaged. I firmly believe I was fucking sabotaged. Um, and that's why I was fired. Um, but that's neither here nor there at this point, right? I, it was two years ago. I know I was sabotaged. None of those ass munchers are really going to do anything for me at this point. But my health still comes first, regardless of what's happened in my life and regardless of what plans I have for the future. And so, like I said, the uploads have really stagnated. I'm trying to cope as best I can, whether that's through family, friends, uh, <laughs> maybe, you know, if I could get it off the drink cap here, the little shelf for it so I don't make a, uh, make a mess or a little bit of alcohol. We're doing what we can. Um, but I want to make this video more than anything to just say I'm here. I'm doing what I can. I have not been this stressed since working at that radio job that I had about maybe six, seven months ago. Um, I'm doing what I can. And I hope that you understand that and that you're on the ride with me for this and that you just keep supporting the channel. Um, life's been tough. I'm doing what I can, and I hope that you fully understand that. So, guys, I'm going to keep uploading content to the best of my ability. I hope that you're going to stay on this journey with me to the best of your ability. I hope that you're still enjoying the content that's on the channel. And uh, I'm, I'm just so appreciative to each and every one of you, whether you watch a video for five seconds or five minutes or the full 10 minutes because you know we got to get that ad revenue in that algorithm <laughs> but uh, i never thought i'd hit a channel with almost 1400 subscribers i mean i've been doing i've been doing youtube videos like if you look to my oldest videos i've been doing this for like over 10 years but i didn't know what i was doing for like the first 10 years it's only within like the last couple of years i really knew what i was doing and i'm just so appreciative I, I love making content. I love making jokes. I love seeing the feedback in the comment section. I love interacting. Ooh, I think I just hit my mic there. I'm sorry. I love interacting with you, the viewer, whether it's on a retrospective or a deck profile or just a discussion. It's so cool to see that feedback. And I, I just hope you know how appreciative I am. Even if I got to go four or five days without uploading a video to just focus on my health so guys thank you for watching i love you very much and i'll speak with you again i hope very very soon